Hey guys, what is going on? This is Jack Attack 45 here with a team of the season Cavani review sponsored by none other than Buy Ultimate Coins. Go check out their link down in the description below if you want to buy some coins. Very reliable site. I bought some yesterday. It was pretty awesome. And we are going to move on to our team of the season Cavani review. 91 pace, 94 shot, 75 pass, 86 dribbling, 70 defense, and 90 heading on this 92 overall striker from Napoli. Also, Uruguayan national. So pretty awesome to play with him. Obviously, kind of a beast. Look at those awesome, awesome blue stats. Awesome, awesome blue card from him. We're going to go right into his in-game stats, then follow it up with some goals. You guys know the deal. Make sure to go check out all the links in the description, and I will see you over at the in-game stats. And here we are at Team of the Season Cavani's in-game stats. As you can see, he is a 92 overall striker, 25 years old, 6 foot tall, 163 pounds from Uruguay. He can play striker, center forward, left wing. I prefer him more at a center forward role as opposed to a striker. He has a preferred right foot, high, high work rates, 3-star skills, and 3-star weak foot. Now, the thing you might notice is high, high work rates. Now... The one of the problems with a striker with high, high work rates is that they get very, very tired, and they will sit a lot farther back, and I notice this a lot with Cavani. He seemed to be out of position, so he's mu I, I feel like he was much better in that center attacking mid role as opposed to the striker, because if you sit him as a striker, he will end up more beh back behind where a center four would be anyway, so uh, he does get a little tired, but it's not a huge, huge deal. Let's move on to his physical attributes, though. 91 acceleration, 97 agility, 98 jumping, 96 reactions, 93 sprint speed, and 81 strength. One thing I really didn't notice was his agility. It seemed a little bit more sluggish. 97 kind of surprised me when I first looked at it, but uh, still, great in-game stats. 99 aggression, 89 attack positioning, which... I was kind of surprised at as well. For a 92 overall striker, you'd think he'd have a little bit better positioning. But 92 ball control, 82 cross, 87 curve, 87 dribbling, 99 finishing, which obviously is super, super important. 81 free kick accuracy, 91 heading accuracy, 96 long shots, 98 penalties, 86 short pass, 99 shot power, and 99 volleys. So as you can see, all the stats that you want – for a beastly striker Cavani has but will those stats show through in the goals and my thoughts on him you'll see in a second all right so here we are over at the goals now first thing about Cavani is I did not really enjoy playing him as a striker I actually liked playing him more in the center forward center attacking mid roll as you can see here pretty good creator uh, in terms of agility, like I said, his 92 agility was kind of surprising when I looked at the in-game stats. He seems a bit more sluggish than that. He does have a l lot of pace and a lot of acceleration, but the agility just really wasn't there. I was playing him with uh, Maximilio Morales up there, and he has pretty high agility as well. And Cavani just really doesn't even compare. I think uh, Morales has about uh, 95, I think and Cavani apparently is supposed to be right around there, so I was pretty surprised that he had 92 agility, but uh, overall, though, he does have all the stats that you need for a striker. Very strong, good in the air, 99 finishing. Obviously, you can't get any better than that, as you see Vidal here, and then Cavani puts it right through the five hole. So uh, the question is, though, really, guys, is he worth the five... Uh, he's going for right around 500,000 right now, and is he worth that 500K? Uh, in my opinion, I would say, and some of you, this might come as not very much of a surprise, I would say no. He's more of a creator than really a hardcore um, finish-it-all-the-time striker, although you can get him in that position. I feel like other players just outshine him. If you think about some of the other players that you can get for 500,000 coins, even in the Serie A, um, like the normal Di Natale seems to fit, seem to finish just as well. Um, obviously, there's a lot of good options in the Serie A. Uh, Di Natale is the one that comes to mind right now, though. But uh, as you can see, he was more setting up Vidal. So uh, I'm going to be re reviewing Vidal tomorrow, the team of the season Vidal, and you guys will see a few goals from him, a few extra goals here. I think most of them are from assisted off Cavani, actually. Nice little long shot here from, I don't know what the defense was doing there, but they are backing off. And uh, Cavani... I expected a little bit more, but at the same time, he is still an amazing player. I did really enjoy playing with him. And as you can see there, he just got really unlucky a few times. But uh, he does win headers very, very easily, as you can see there. But 
is he worth the 500 coins? I would say you want to pass on this one. Unless you're trying to build the full team of the season, uh, Italian squad, I would pass on Mr. Team of the Season Cavani. Team of the Season Vidal might be a little bit different story. I will um, make sure to review him tomorrow. And then I think we're setting up with a Team of the Season Di Natale. So it should be a good time, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the Cavani review. That was one of the most amazing runs from a striker I've ever seen. No idea how uh, he got that ball, but... He does make some good plays. I just don't think he's worth the 500000 So go check out his normal 88-rated uh, inform maybe first if you like that one. Then definitely go with the 92. But if you just want to play with a beastly player who does not get head kicked in the face as you saw there, oh, yeah, go just go pick up the normal Cavani. He is a beast as well. Guys, I hope you did enjoy. This has been Jack Attack 45 signing out. Peace.